my sports picture to the okay, guy like to take out our fingers. Good idea with the video. We're back with another uh, back with another uh, video. It's today's video. Obviously we are here on this uh this journey. Okay. Okay, this is a little freaking music shit. It's, it's, how do you turn the music thing like off off like off limits, like off loud? Because it's very annoying. Um by the way, we're level three. So yeah, today's video. Obviously, we are here uh, to continue the journey on this ho hog maze. I, I believe this was this map called the uh, this world maze. The it's the hog maze map. Yeah, hogs made. Yeah, this is hogs made. The a village town. That's what we're doing today's video and uh, and all the other type of stuff. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it we're doing. And uh, you, once again, thank y'all supporting the series here and there. Uh, that means a lot to me in this world. Um, honestly, I'm gonna put this at 50 because uh, the the music's too damn loud. And uh, yeah, we go from there. We're level three. Uh, I think that the more the more like post the more of the uh, the spells we learn from, the more the progress we get towards the story and all that type of stuff. And uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get to Hogwarts Legacy. I'm wasting none of your time. Let's keep on going. Uh, let's see what else we get to do in this town now. Um, it says go. It says visit. Uh, visit the potions. Uh, I'm guessing we get like more health and all type of stuff in the, if we go there. But who knows? I could be. I could be wrong. Um, but we're gonna visit there. Visit the potion thing. And then that's what we're gonna do. We'll go from there. It's the post shot right here. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Oh, what's up? Sir? Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is yeah. it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions, potions for all, for all ailments. Yeah, okay. You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're yeah. the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. Yeah, it is. Uh, so great. But make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And I unveil new ones from time to time. Mm. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for so now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Yeah. So basically, what can I do for you today? So basically, whatever potions that you know that he can make and all type of stuff. I guess it we we. I guess if uh, I guess he'll give us these potions and all type of stuff. So these are like focus potions. Small creatures, maybe and all that type. Of, I guess he'll create a potion for us. I'm not sure. Recipe of potions that reduce the drinking spell health cooldown. Oh, it said recipe for power damage potion. Oh, yep. Recipe for, for potions that drinks are practically that, that makes a drinker practically invisible. I see people players do a recipe that increase the drinker spell damage for a limited amount of time. So there's potions that uh, that he can make that uh, that can that can oh, wow, help us decision. with damage, uh, healing. Feel free to take we a look at the rest one. of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Yeah, we got potions that can you know heal or do whatever. That's and, and these are kind of like you know you know you know kind of things you need to make a potion. We'll probably learn more about that as time goes on. I hope on. to see you again. Farewell for now. So so we got eight potions now. Step five or three, I'm not sure. Like, okay, interesting. All right, let's go to the magic one. I'm assuming we're gonna learn more magic. It gives like more magic ability powers or something like that. 
that's the one area. The the visit the the magic depth, whatever it is called. This one's called the magic deck. Yep. And we're right behind it too. That's really cool. We're right behind it. Oh, it's the ladder. Hold on. Is that the ladder I see? Do I see that ladder? Screw that. Yeah, I figure. I figure I saw that ladder. So that's this is Levioso. Well, hello there. Levioso. Akio is when we when we pull when we like pull things over here. Levioso when we lift things up in the air. Okay. Potatoes when we defend. Okay. Oh, hello there. Please. Go Pardon me, sir. I'm here yeah. for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Yeah. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Yes. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Uh, it's a lock the ability to grow dining in small pots. So basically, this will help us you know, make more potion for, uh, for health or whatever. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Yep, ingredients to help them make potions or whatever. Interesting. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. All right, well, interesting. Okay, now we can finally go get our wand to create create one. Finally, create our wand. Where can we go? The outlines, yes. Right here. We are one there, and then we go from there. Okay. Alright. So far, I'm so good. I'm liking the whole entire story of the Hogwarts Legacy here and there. It's really good, though. But it's going to be a long journey, though. A really long journey. She stands her ground but I'm all, I'm all in for the long journey. I'm all in for it. Especially this game is new. It's, it came out in 2023. Now, I believe this is the part, if I'm not correct, if y'all hear Harry Potter fan, y'all know this is the part where Harry Potter gets his wand and then he, he has no idea what to find, like, the legit right one. And then finally, the person who made a wand for him found him the right, right one. I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Of course, these are the ones. Ah, uh, hello, sir. I'm looking for, for a new wand. Yes. It's about time. Yes. Uh, about time? Well, you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, yeah. what am I saying? Of course yep. you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. You it's don't a say. pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with Thank me. You. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? Hmm. Uh, this no, is the part where no, where, no, where Harry you. Potter kind of oh, where Harry Potter do oh, to try to make him one of yes. Harry Potter, and things yes. didn't go right, mm. and then next thing you know they oh, finally found oh. Harry Potter one. Ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. And then that doesn't work. Well, go ahead, swish. It swish and the thing go wrong. Yep. Hmm. Kind of oh, like Harry oh. Potter. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. And it's gonna bust it. Yup. Uh oh. Oh dear. Like Harry Potter. This is if this is just like Harry Potter, you can well, literally clip a, the, match all, a Harry Potter it? film clip, <laughs> hip, clip uh, a Harry um, Potter clip on this one, on on we'll this on on the Harry Potter clip on into the Hogwarts mm. Legacy one. No, not you. Uh, it's just the exact same uh, thing. Hmm. Perhaps. 
Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Now that should work. Or not. Oh, 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 my. oh goodness. Okay, well. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Well. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. No, this is I'm just like the Harry Potter scene. Um, I'm liking this. Where are you? I'm liking I this. I like the like when they relate stuff to the movie oh, to the game. I like there it. There you are. Where is it? Yes. I think you might be the one. Here. Take it. What's this? Oh, this is the one. Oh, of course, we can create a one, right? The way how it is, how long it is. Okay, that's the say finalized one. Okay, so we can create a one. They say naturally great. Indeed. I mean, buff. <laughs> what the hell? How intriguing. I ain't gonna lie, the white the whites look very very clean. Classic whites. Curious indeed. Spiritual. Oh, like a spiritual crystal thing. That's really cool. It's honey brown. Oh. How bone. intriguing. Warm brown. Look kind of bony. Ring buff. Curious indeed. Hmm. I mean, I mean the whites look really clean for real, for real. How intriguing! Hold on. L little ring, look like a clarinet a little bit. But it looks pale brown. Curious indeed. I don't like that one. Okay, it says nine and a half inches. How 14, intriguing. Fourteen and a half inches. I ain't gonna lie, I love a length of one anyway. Wood type. Black Curious horn. indeed. What? I mean, what's the difference? It doesn't even show the difference for real. For real. How intriguing. Solid, rough, fairly bent. Hold on, fairly, Curious very indeed. flexible. Sw swishy. What the? Fairly, fairly bent. So wait, hold on a second. Nothing really changed in this wine, for me, not this unicorn here. Ah, Phoenix Feather. Exceptionally rare, and a core with a strong sense of initiative. So it's like a wand core, like a, when a, you put up a wand, it'll, it'll do like a great range of magic, track it, and reduce the power for magic. Ooh. I have a unicorn, half unicorn thing. Great range magic. Ooh. But I love this powerful A dragon magic. heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Say less. What do you think? Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. Awesome. Ah. <laughs> I mean that white that white wand now, looks crystal. It looks really feel? good. Good, different. That white wand looks really clean. Some kind, a match. So I had to use that one. seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. 
and the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds mm. wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Well, I appreciate that. Well, really that's everything. Better go and find Natty. Yeah. Well, 39, like, whatever. I mean, the white wand looks really quick. Cri cri really, really looks like. I like it when it looks like clean and all that type of stuff. And with the white wand color, it looks kind of clean. So I, I kind of dig it. And I can see the wand a, a lot better, too, as well. I really wish we could, like, mix the white, mix the white wand with the black color or something like that. Like, something like that. I don't know. I guess in this game, you can't do that. But it is what it is. I'm going to use this white wand anyway. So, yeah. Now we've done all that, we can be over Nancy, and then we go over to oh, the beer place. I'm sorry. I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Okay. Oh, what the hell? Oh, shit. Oh, it's, oh, it's, it's one of those goblin, it's one of those goblin things. I think that's Ragnarok people. Oh, well, we gotta take him now. Or we gotta take them down before we gotta take that guy down. Dodge. Or oh, Ruby is Hagrid. Look at you. We need to make sure he stays that way. I'm trying. Oh. Are we gonna talk about the fact that Daddy got her ass like handed to her? Like look at this. Oh, oh I oh, I gotta see it again. I gotta see it again. Daddy get out the way. Okay. Okay. Okay, I can't see it again. <laughs> but then he got her, her fucking ass kicked. Invoke patient magic? Oh! Oh, shit! Hey, we destroyed those trolls. But that's Goodness. what I'm Reg Ross like. Second troll. Henchman, I Did believe. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? No, I no shit. so. We did. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, Wait, Officer. What do you mean by that? Singer. Officer Singer. Oh, you are officer you. in this town? Oh, okay. Oh, so you're an officer in this town, huh? Oh, interesting. Oh. oh hello there. Um, Repair. 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 Oh. Repair. I mean, I mean, well, first, you gotta rebuild this up first. Hold on a second. Yeah, 
luckily they didn't Officer Singer to worry about. Tower repair all this four out of how many on this area did you guys say? Okay. Repair. Oh. Repair up. That's so nothing happened. As nothing happened. One more. Okay, that was weird. That was behind us, but alright. We were just talking about you. Really, Natty? I think you got your ass whooped? Yeah, sure. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should so like you to do thank clothing. you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. Mm. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. A clothing? I am Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I I'm suspect listening. this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Okay. I Thank sis. You, Come on. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. It's uh, where now, we can help Ruby as heck. I'm down side, with it. Shall we? Hey, so if y'all don't... Your perusal today. Take your time. So if you guys don't know what this is, this is basically a wizard wear type of uh, stuff you, you wear. These are the uh, stuff that, that will um, that will help you on your, uh, on your, uh, on your defense and, and whatever. Uh, you know, all the type of stuff, your offensive defense. There are going to be some some um, some uh, stuff you wear that could get you more to your offense than your defense and all that type of stuff. And so you have to be like legitimately like be careful and all that type of stuff if you want to uh, legitimize what's going on. So what we have right now, what, we got a wizard thing. Wait, how much it costs? Typically unavailable. So all of these are un unavailable, but... These are important if you want to get your your uh, your um, your character stronger. Uh, th these outfits can help you with your offense and defense and all type of stuff. Now, beware! There are going to be some items that are going to have way more offensive to your character, but then they might take away your defense and all type of stuff. So be careful on that one. So yeah, um, right now we got this. You won't be disappointed. That's a glad. You new piece of hardware. We're tied to equipment. Okay. Okay, what we got here? Okay, what is it? Yes. It's the exact same thing. And now, and now with all that being said, uh, yeah, these. If I haven't said it before, it's a pleasure doing business. I suspect yeah. you have a sharp eye for fashion. What an extraordinary yeah, introduction yeah, yeah. to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butter beer. Shall we head to the Three Broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Yeah. Even Just though we building. have the exact same fucking clothing. But at least we got a defense above. At least we're level three, I, I think. So yeah, the gear will help us better with all the types. So this is our new freaking row thing. That help us on our thing. We don't have a uh, ha ha heart. We don't have head headwear. We don't have uh, face wear. We don't have hand wear. We don't have necklace necklace wear and all type of stuff. But I think as time goes on, as we're going into deep into this game, we might we might get there, along with the potions and all type of stuff. We chose our wand. Wait, this is a cool wand, duh. Oh wait, so you can tell me that if we get we can get other ones to help us more. With uh, our offense and our defense sort of thing, that'd be really cool. So yeah, if you really want to get, you really want to get your hands on the one fashion wear and all types of stuff because it does help you on your offense and defense. So yeah, that's that. Okay. All right, let's go. Yeah. 
Let's go. Let's get my body here. Let's go to this beer place. Are we too, a little bit too young to drink beer? Assuming Bruce? it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and Serona. a powerful witch. Okay. Good one to know. Interesting. Serona. So she's like this bartender probably at the broomsticks? The three broomsticks? I don't know. Oh, shit. Yup, Ragnarok. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched oh. a student take down your distraction. Of course. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Let's go. Did they see us? I, I think they think did. So. What was that they goblin did. doing with Victor Rookwood? You don't Ranrock tell me. Working with Rookwood? Yeah, Ranrock is working with The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Mm-hmm. He's most wanted. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Yeah. So apparently this Victor Rockwood do is, uh... Is one it's of a treat uh, to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Oh, Serona so, so sounds like, like a very interesting lady. That you want to smash? Okay, I'm tripping. Now, what can I? Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see okay, you've so, escaped injury. Okay, so Thanks uh, to this one, single handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Yeah. Well done. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for this. My Ruby pleasure. has got this. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Yee. Red Rock brought those right. trolls here. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <laughs> are Victor, Victor Rockwood? Yeah, you don't say. No time, man. Mm, how interesting. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. Theophilus. No need for theatrics. That's his, that's his buddy. I'm only here for this one anyway. This is Victor's buddy. My oh, friend no. is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Yeah. I want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Perhaps you don't understand. I said, my friend is busy. Yeah, tell Sarona. I would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Yeah. Think twice, Victor. Come, Theophilus. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Take your shit faces Can't elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Yep. Well, we're number one hit list on Victor's uh, hit list, of course. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Yeah, you know, say. Back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Mm -hmm. Trolls, yep. Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Yeah. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. Some of the quests have opened. I mean... So we got Victor... So we got Victor Rockwood. Uh, that uh, so Ram Rock hired Victor Rockwood and his um, other friend I forgot his name's called uh, to get to hire to hunt us down because we know something about ancient magic and shit. Yeah, yeah. Ram Rock's not stopping until he find us, and he hired Victor to 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 literally hunt us down, literally. So welcome to Hogwarts. Oh, it's been a long day. All I want to do is find my room and crawl to bed. You don't say. 
Well, we gotta talk to Nat Natalie about what's going there. on. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Rookwood and Harlow. I yep. want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. Oh, she'll know. She'll know 100%. She's not stupid. You must turn your common room for a night. <sighs> Select the button map to switch to Hogwarts map. Of course. Travel to your common room. Um, where's the common room? Okay. It's a common room. We go there. We fast travel. Okay. See, yeah, so it's a good thing we got those green things all fired up. The flu, the green flames, because that's the travel. Uh, that's the fast travel point uh, that gives us that faster. That's a long ass day. And we're level three steel. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, well. Time to uh, check out the quests. Talk to Lucian. Uh, is it, I will speak to Lucian about this duel. Wait, what? There are no main missions. No main missions available. Okay. So don't main mission, eh? Okay. The wings on. Okay, so these are places. So the black, so the black, the flags are the places. Oh, the week you need to go to faster. Oh, okay. So these are not like side missions or anything. That's that's unfortunate. Like I said, I only care about the quests at this point. The main quests are the, are the main big thing that I cared about. Oh. oh speaking of main quests, hold on a second. There we, we got another inventory. We got we got another gear. Hold on. No, we don't. We got another gear. You got freaking kidding me. Whatever. All right. Well, there's nothing else is going on for real, for real. New quest available. Oh, no, my. Reach the owls. Owls this one? What's this? Professor Fix. Come and see me. I'm, I'm discovering something in the lock we found at, at Grit, Grit, Grit Gods, whatever. Bet. We go there. Okay, we got an objective. I need to tell Professor Fix about the trolls' attacks in Hogsbane, and I'd like to find out if he learned more about what lock we found in the uh, Gringotts, basically down in that cave we found there. Um, okay, let's go down there. Hold on. So we got a new quest. Is there any requirements? No, it's not. So I'm guessing this is like a side mission, or this is something we might have to do later on. With the uh, with uh, Spencer, because I believe Spencer told us to see Luke Lucan about the doing club, whatever. But right now, let's talk to the Professor real quick. Because I'm very interested what he has to say about this whole entire thing. Um, can we get here? Yeah, we can. Yes, sir. Go. Here we go. Keep on running. Keep going. Excuse me, buddy. Oh, man. Okay. One thing I like about this game is that we can run the objective fast enough. Wait, hold on a second. Can we travel? Can we travel faster? Go. Oh, we can just travel, travel faster. <laughs> to get here. I was gonna actually do this whole time wall walk shit. Professor. Professor, I'm glad to see you. What's up? And I, you. Thank Merlin, you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? 
Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The yep. trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have had Serona and the patrons at the Three Brumsticks not intervened. Thank God Serona's out indeed. there. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Yep, basically. And, and they wouldn't and they want to know what's going on. Speaking of the vault, yeah. do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? Probably. I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. Uh, but no, they could be working with I the dare say, Ranrock after what happens to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. Right, sure, no followers to them. They're off the that. locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic That's down That's what the, the Sebastian map. was telling me about. I suspected you would see something. Should we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit. Before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book. But we should be prepared for anything. anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. All right. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Okay, say less. So let's go then. Let's go to Professor then. Let's, let's teach more about the defense of the magic, whatever. Okay. So basically, they're out of that vault steal. Both Victor and, uh... Both Victor and, uh... And of course, uh... And of course, uh, Renrock. They're both at that vault because that vault, I believe, it, it reviews something about, like, um, ancient magic. Or some dark magic that maybe Renrock's out there and we cannot let that happen, but... I see too many of these games under where we don't we allow something to happen and it, we allow something to happen and it doesn't happen. But it does happen and it just got worse. Come on. Alright, so yeah, keep on going. Might some kind soul help me? Nope. I'm not helping you. Bye. Jesus. Professor. Okay. Uh, I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Teach Good. me. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. Mm -hmm. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire making spell, handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs. And, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Mm. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. So Incendio's like a burn you know magic that burns enemies? You'll find me you've finished. All right, so we got complete like a spell combination or something like that, and they report right back. Seems crossed wands isn't as secret as it's believed to be. If only a new student was helping. If only you shut the hell up and leave me alone. Jesus Christ, I ain't got time for your shit. What do I have to? Yeah. All right, let's keep on going. Let's really keep on going. <laughs> 
All right. All right. So we gotta combine some new magic, something like that. Okay, that's low Whee! level. Huh? Oh, not again. Here I've come from the toilet yeah, bowl, where she said I could swim. What the fuck? Hey, yo! As All long right. As we're only one time per week, I can yo, avoid <laughs> these things can talk in this game. It's pretty cool, but like, it's pretty weird. Glad you can make it. Lucan's just over there. Uh, wait, what? Oh, is this what do? Sebastian okay. told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I'm flattered to hear that. Okay. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does Cross Wands work exactly? exactly. You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. So basically, so another duel. So we're the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Why not? Spectacular! Let uh, the fireworks begin! I guess this is what I gotta go to, right? We'll make you regret signing up. Traction spelling, yellow spelling, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yellow orbs. No. There we go. Pity more people can't watch the duels. Hmm. Hmm, took those two down easy. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. In fact, the second duel is ready when you are. And as a fully initiated member, you now have access to the official Crossed Ones training dummy. Very good way to master spell combinations. Come and see me and I'll set it up. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Thank you, Lucan. Hope to see you back here again. Was that it? Oh. oh okay. So, so now what? Win two, win two rounds of complete the round so the combination spread. Why not? We we go back to him. Oh man, you hello. What's the next? What's the all set? Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of crossed ones all set? Why, yeah. Yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Yes. I'm ready. Might as well. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Um. I mean. Are you dueling with a partner? No. I'll be dueling solo. Then let's get to it. I'm doing by myself. Ready to get thrashed? <laughs> Apologies in advance. Wait, it's the only it's one against three. Oh shit. Maybe I should have brought Natty with me. Well, I'm I'm kinda dumb. I might get actually Oh, I'm so <laughs> fucked. Oh my god. Let me 
Wow, I just what took those. Do? What a duel. Y'all three trash. <laughs> I just took three of y'all now. I was just what spamming. Way? I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you. But after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance of winning. Or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. It... I guess the next it. round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Complete the round spell come to practice with I gotta do another one this shit man. Hello Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? Yes. That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all of your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay, does it... So this is like combination. Yeah, I knew that. Good one. Levioso. Levioso. So, you know, whatever, they're gonna make us combine it. Here we go. Let me go. Yeah, I, I think I basically did that already. It's, it's not the easy. That's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. It's too easy. It's better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. So, assignments all finished. So we can go back now. Oh, and I'm level four. Hey, and you love to see it. You will see it. Okay. okay. So we so we got that done. All right. Okay. Here we go. Fast travel. I think we be should we should be good for now. I hope I it was a creature induced injury, but I don't think so. Oi, can you help me? Man, all right, Arthur. Arthur. Hello there. Perhaps you can help me. What do you want, Arthur? Hello. Were you calling me? I was. Yes. Thought perhaps a fellow Hufflepuff might have the perseverance to join me in a bit of an adventure. Oh Following God. Following a treasure map to be precise. Slight respite from battling the odd troll, I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein. I found two maps lying about, both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Uh, hey, look. Uh, I'll, think, I'll think about it. Why would I want to decipher an old map? Yeah. For the sheer knowledge of it, Hogwarts fascinates me. Plus... You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair yep. enough. Meet me back here if you find anything. Uh, whatever. Oh, it's a clue. And then we need to use Rubioso, whatever. Oh, no. Bro, find a first landmark from the trip. I'm not, I'm not doing that. No, wait, wait, I have to do that? Oh, great. I literally just, I just literally shit the bed. What did I do that for? Now I have literally. Why did I do this, man? Oh. What am I supposed to find? Of oh, the map. I should have just said hell no. Press clue. It shows on the on the on the on the on the Renaissance skeleton display. I must know I want at least 
where is this Renaiso whatever this shit is Renaiso 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 whatever Renaiso arrows whatever it is This is so stupid. Is it in the class? No, it's not. Dude. This is bullshit. So bullshit. Of course. What does, what does he mean by that? I have no idea what he what he meant by that. Can we just focus on the main mission? Okay, this one sucked. Uh, the secret. Yeah. Um. I need to get Okay. Yeah, I'm not. Forest clues show us landmark. That's our Arthur's treasure map. We're focusing on that. Forget about this. We're not. I'm not even focusing on the Arthur thing. I'm sorry, Arthur. You're gonna have to wait. You probably have to do this off camera because that's. This is not even important for real. I had to do this off camera because uh, that that was a bit of waste of, of my absolute time. Um, all right, so where do we go here? Yeah, we go run over here. Yes. Okay, here we go. Yes. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Yep. Mm -hmm. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say, I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that fire is a fickle servant. Mm -hmm. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. Go learn a new flame move. This is the first red move, I believe. This will light, light up our opponents on fire, light up our enemies on fire. Okay, you have learned enough spells that you need to equip uh, uh, in and so deal in your spell set. Uh, your spell set to do this, you need to swap out different spells. Good okay. Work. Oh, so these are different spells that we can learn throughout the course of the uh, of the game. I ain't gonna lie. Do we really need hold to a sign? I mean, it says yeah, it does damage, like burning damage. Okay. Um. So how in the world? Side to the bottom or side to the roof. Maybe the bottom? I mean, do we need repair of For real, for real? No, we don't. Need Level five, yes. Incendio. Oh, so this is short range. So this is not a long range test. So we gotta get close, like. Incendio. Getting it. Keep at it. And do try not to incinerate yourself. Let me go. Okay. Hey. Okay. That's not bad. I should report back to Professor Fade. Let him know that I learned. Yeah, okay. So we got the fire section. Ah, a rhinoceros skeleton. I'm on the right track. No. No one nice to sell it. Bye. Not even focus on that Arthur shit till we maybe do off camera. 
Maybe I might do it off camera to do it to do the whole Arthur thing. I might have to do a whole thing off camera. Right now we just gotta focus on on this. Uh, where do we go to? Right here, yeah. Yeah, we gotta learn to tell the professor that we learn the new fire remove. So we got, you know what? We gotta get really close to the to the fire remove. Though we learn more more of the the red moves as time as time goes on. All right, professor. All right. Yeah, I just basically I just went I just basically went around for no reason. Only a new Fuck play. off. Yeah. Am I dangerous? Like, come on now. I may have went the wrong way. Okay. Give me a way there. Okay. Jeez. There we go. I get in there, man. Damn. Thank you very much. I'll keep getting there. Alright. Ah, sir? there you are. Yeah. What's up? Talk Hello, to us, sir. Professor. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Hackett. Oh, so I was so I hear, magic? She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. Oh, you okay. must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. Mm -hmm. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig, I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office, five minutes. Of course, Professor Black, you know you're white. Of course, this dude has a problem. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. We gotta need Sebastian help. We have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. That's fine. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. You go ahead, do what you gotta do. I'm going to find a way to get to the restricted area. The only way we do that, we gotta get Sebastian and his other friends to get us to the restricted area to that library to get that book for that ancient magic for Professor uh, Figs or whatever we need to discover in the library, whatever we need to do. Besides the ancient magic, I don't know. So yeah, we gotta talk to Sebastian, but we're gonna talk to him next episode. Uh, so yeah, thank y'all for watching. You like subscribe, and as always, take care. I'm out. Peace. To the ones that told me to quit, look at me now. I could be the greatest of all time. I know that I can do it. You just gotta let me try.